Hmm. Are there still plays that I would say nobody really knows about? Is there a play that could potentially make you a ton of money? Are there still top 20 cryptocurrencies where you really haven't heard of them because, well, let's just say they aren't very sexy. They aren't a Bitcoin. They aren't a Ethereum. They aren't a Dogecoin. They aren't a Luna. In fact, they're pretty boring. In fact, they're hidden. And in fact, it's a ninja ready to strike and let me show you how and why. What's up everyone, it's Hey John, and today I want to talk about this gem called Algorand. If you never heard of it, there's good reason for it. As I've just said, it's not very sexy, it's not very interesting, so nobody knows about it. In my own experience in using Algorand, I found that it's super quick, you use it, it happens, there's no hiccups. I've never experienced any downtime. I've never experienced any network congestion, so to speak. I just submit it and it works and it's always cheap. I don't see the price fluctuate like with Ethereum or even Binance Smart Chain. Even Binance Smart Chain, it goes from like say 10 cents to a few dollars sometime. But with Algorand, it's always been the same price. Could this be the hidden ninja that nobody knows about but it's literally a sleeping giant. And let me show you and tell you why it is. Universal Music Group to release NFTs on LimeWire's Algorand Marketplace. As we know in the cryptocurrency space, NFTs are going to be the future. The metaverse is going to be the future. Now LimeWire, if you recall, back in the early 2000s, it was a pirating service where you go and type in a name, and you can download for free. Now they are going with a different approach. It is still decentralized because even with a previous LimeWire, when you were downloading stuff, it was coming from other computers, other users who would send you the files. And now they are continuing their journey in a decentralized fashion, but they are now going into the NFT route. And guess what blockchain is powering it? Algorand. What? How could that be? For perspective, Universal Music Group is making tons of revenue. Why would they go with LimeWire? And why would they go with Algorand of all the things in the world? They could go with the rock stars, Ethereum, right? But no, they don't go that route for a reason because it's too expensive. And Algorand is cheap, it's fast, it's secure, and well, nobody knows about it. LimeWire is back to bring digital collectibles to everybody. Partner and advisory board, CEO Algorand, right there. Universal Music Group, 9.4 billion in 2021. We're seeing Algorand, a blockchain, moving into a more public limelight and creating real utility, going into the real world. We're not just seeing pictures of NFTs of some ape or robot. No, these are actual artists, musicians, and they are going through Universal Music Group into LimeWire, powered by the Algorand blockchain. And the reason why they went this route is because, as I said before, in all of my time of using Algorand, I've never seen any downtime. But I'm looking at you, Solano. You're always having downtime because you're always fixing bugs. But Algorand, no, they're always on and they're always working, irregardless of whatever issues they're having. If they're having issues, I am never aware of them. And that's the way the blockchain should work. It shouldn't be where you have network congestion and then it becomes slow. I'm looking at you, Binance Smart Chain. And it shouldn't be expensive and you have ridiculous gas fees. I'm looking at you, Ethereum. And there shouldn't always be downtime. I'm looking at you, Solana. So imagine what happens when Universal Music Group and they apply their revenue stream to LimeWire and the Algorand blockchain. Imagine how many NFT transactions you have to do. And you have to do it seamlessly where there is no downtime, there is no issues. And Algorand, in my opinion, from what I've seen, is the route to go. And there's a reason why they've chosen them. It's because of the reason I just told you. No downtime, cheap, seamless, and almost instant. You click it, done. And you can see it almost instantly. When I first used the Algorand blockchain, I was like, whoa, what is this? It's so quick. Is this right? Just like all of you, I'm used to all the excuses where it's slow, it's down, it's expensive. So when I used this, I was actually in shock. I was like, wait, 
this is a bizarre thing. Like, okay, 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 I like this. FIFA announces partnership with blockchain innovator Algorand. Another significant and huge partnership, Algorand and now soccer, FIFA. Ladies and gentlemen, this industry is ginormous. It's huge. They bring in so much revenue. And for the same reason, why would they go with Algorand, a blockchain that most of us most likely have never heard of. And if we have heard of it, we just brush it off to the side because what about it? Exactly. What about it? There's a reason why nobody knows about Algorand. It isn't sexy. It isn't fun. It isn't exciting, but it sure is functional. And they will be the backbone for all of these large ventures. Imagine how many soccer NFTs you can mint. Whether they be players, tickets, you name it, it can be done on the Algorand blockchain. And just imagine how much money and revenue this will generate. FIFA brought in $766 million in 2021. So I want to emphasize, folks, imagine how many transactions this is. Of course, with Universal Music Group, it's a bigger revenue stream. But remember, folks, think of transactions per second and how many you will need to execute in a timely and seamless fashion. Nigeria to launch major crypto initiative, IP exchange marketplace and wallet on Algorand in partnership with developing Africa group and Koi banks. Now we're seeing a country looking to use Algorand as the Al1 blockchain of choice to power their wallets. Now you're thinking, okay, Africa, cool. But Nigeria is one of the wealthiest African countries out there. Nigeria's GDP is 1.14 trillion. Universal Music Group, you have stars such as Taylor Swift, Kendrick Lamar, BTS, and they have a revenue stream of around nine plus billion dollars. And now you're seeing a country of Nigeria, the richest country in Africa of around 1.1 trillion dollars yearly why would all of these revenue streams decide to use algorand because they've done their due diligence think about it folks ethereum gas fees there's no way people can afford those gas fees imagine buying something for one dollar and then paying a gas fee of say 20 or 50 bucks it is ridiculous it is not sustainable with all that being said what do you think about algorand do you think it's a hidden ninja that nobody knows about? And why is it such a hidden secret? Why doesn't anyone talk about Algorand? Why is it so quiet? When I discovered this and when I realized this, I said, oh my God, I need to get me some of this. I am genuinely curious. If you heard of Algorand, leave me a comment down below of why you think why nobody knows about Algorand, but yet they are such a sleeping giant. And I believe they are ready to come to prime time sooner rather than later. Make sure you guys like, share, and subscribe to this channel. And most importantly, have an awesome day, and I will catch you all on next one. Shh.